Hello, this is Ebus Mac Tutorials, and this is my fourth Java question from Answers.com. And uh, this question asks, how? Uh, let me pull it up. What method returns a copy of a string without trailing spaces? And so, I suppose what they are asking is, if you have a string like you know, yada, like that, it would return yada like that. And I mean, I'm not saying these brackets are part of it. I mean whatever's inside these brackets is part of the string, then it would return whatever's inside these brackets. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not saying that, that the bracket's included. And it says returns, so it looks like we're going to be using a method here again. Um, that returns a copy of a string without trailing spaces. Um, actually, it's asking for a method like a um, method call, I suppose. Like, it's asking for, so we have string A equals high. It's asking for method as in a dot length. I think that kind of method. But um, uh, I'm going to put it in a method. Actually, I'm not going to put it in a method. I'm just going to do it in the main class. So anyway, say you have a string um, too many spaces equals like that. Okay, space, 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 however many spaces, space, and then a couple spaces, this. And so it doesn't want these spaces turned in the middle, but it means trailing. So trailing here and trailing here, I would imagine, is what it's asking to get rid of. And so say we have string good spaces, spaces equals, and the method is dot trim. So it works like this. You put your string called, in this case, too many space dot trim. And you pass it no parameters, it doesn't need parameters. And so if we do system out dot print lin, and I'm just going to put a um, little line here, uh, plus too many space pace, S P A C E. Plus, and the reason I'm doing this is so you can see where it starts and ends. So this will be on either side, smashed together without any spaces to this, but of course with these spaces, but without any other spaces um, added onto it extra. Like if we did that, it would have an extra space added, where as we're not. So this will, there would be one of these right, when it prints it out, there will be one of those right there, and one of those right here. I'm assuming all goes well. And so, then we're going to do system dot system dot out dot println, and then we're going to do the same thing. Plus, but instead we're going to do good spaces, the second string we created plus. Um, oops, that's not an i. It's one of. Why did I type an i? Okay, let me change this real quick. Um, to, okay, so um, this space right here is meaningless. It doesn't mean anything. It's just for readability. That is the same as that. It's just more readable when you do it that way. It doesn't mean it's adding extra spaces to it at all. So if you run this, look at that. See? It removed all of the trailing spaces, but it left the spaces in the middle. Ta-da! So that is, um, so the method, I guess the question was the method that you use, and so the answer is dot trim, or trim. Uh, it applies to strings, and to use it, you do your strings dot trim, uh, pass it no parameters, so trim left parent right parent, and um, that is pretty much it for this tutorial. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time, as Kurt J. Mack would say.